Hi, welcome to ACM. Today, let's learn about natural dyes. How would our clothes look without colors? The world would be so much duller. The pigments that make colors on clothes are called dyes. Natural dyes are made directly from objects in nature, like plants, for instance. Whereas synthetic dyes are manufactured from chemicals. Have you ever wondered how humans first started dyeing fabrics? Back then, colors were extracted from the nature around them. They made dyes from vegetables, fruits, trees, rocks, and sometimes even insects. Many Asian communities developed their own techniques to make and color their beautiful fabrics. In Southeast Asia, for example, the ikat method involves dyeing individual threads before they are woven together. Of course, we won't be using insects or animals to create our dyes today. Follow a textile artist in a step-by-step -step guide on how to give your fabrics new colors. Hello, I'm Autumn and I am a textile artist and natural dyer in Singapore. I learned natural dyeing from artisans in Indonesia and India. I will be showing you how to dye fabric and yarn at home with a few simple ingredients. I'll be using turmeric for the dye to dye a piece of square fabric which I can use as a bandana or a scarf. Besides turmeric, here are some other ingredients that you can use. Are you ready? I'll show you how to make the turmeric dye now. You need the following items. Fresh turmeric root or powder for your dye. Unsweetened soy milk as binder to help the fabric absorb more dye. Water. Weighing scale. Mortar and pestle. Rubber gloves so you don't get dye stains on your hands. Laundry detergent. Some rubber bands and marbles. Paddle or ladle for stirring large stainless steel pot, white coloured cotton fabric and yarn. To clean the fabric, wash it with laundry detergent in hot water and rinse well. Dissolve detergent in water, add fabric and simmer for an hour. Rinse well when it's cool enough to handle. We now have clean fabric ready to go into the soy milk bath. This step helps the fabric take up the dye better and make the colour last longer. Mix one part unsweetened soy milk with five parts water. Add the clean damp fabric. Soak for 24 hours, stirring occasionally so that the fabric is evenly coated with soy milk. Wring the fabric and hang to dry. Do not rinse out the soy milk. Keep the dried soy milk treated fabric in a clean bag and let it cure for one week. Pound fresh turmeric and add to the water in a stainless steel pot. Simmer for one hour. Strain and keep the dye liquid for use later. Lay the fabric flat on the table. Pinch the middle and lift it up. Tie a rubber band at different sections. Feel free to experiment with other tying techniques too. Wet the soy milk treated fabric before adding to the dye bath. Rinse the dyed fabric and remove the rubber bands. 
Rinse it again and hang dry. There you have it! Your very own naturally dyed fabric. Wasn't that interesting? You'll have so much fun doing this at home. There are so many ways to make natural dyes. And there are many ways to dye fabrics, which result in different effects on different fabrics. Natural dyes are still being used today as people think more about sustainability and eco-friendly options. Here are some textiles from Asia that were very likely coloured with natural dyes. Spot them on your next visit to ACM!